if you don't know what you're doing, AI can kind of help. But if you do know what you're doing and then you add AI to it, it can turn you into a goddamn genius, right? That's, mm-hmm. that's my experience where I'm doing stuff that was not available to me not very long ago. I have a limited bit of information. I understand the system, the concepts, but I can't get past that until I bring in AI. So that has been kind of a game changer. So whenever you find that, that your GPT doesn't realize what you're talking about, or it's looking at an older set of data, what I literally do is I go to wherever that new data is, I print as PDF and I upload that to my chat. Yeah. So, so people don't realize <laughs> it's, it's called generative, generative AI for a reason. It, it never yeah. tells you no. It's it'll right. make up BS. It's yep. it, that's that <laughs> last twenty percent is probably BS. So like always double check. Have that human in the loop. Yeah. Um, yeah. So so yeah. It's it's great from the the perspective of you know in the future there's going to be people and there's going to be people plus AI and yeah. the people who uh, regardless of what you do right now I talked to someone on my podcast this week he's in Hollywood and he's a producer and he says like you're going to have to adapt to use these tools like you can pick it and complain and all those things like that. Because if you don't do it, our competitors are going to do it. And if our competitors aren't in the United States, it's going to be the China's of the world. Mm-hmm. Right. Yep. And so it's going, you're going to have to adapt. This is happening whether you want it to or not. 